Super quick update for everyone. I have a huge recommendation for you guys. If you love disc golf, ultimate or freestyle, anything frisbee related, the best frisbee documentary ever made is now available free on YouTube. So a link in the description, hopefully somewhere up here as well to just to click it and check it out. It's an hour of education about the history of the sports, great footage, great interview with all the legends and the greats of all the sports involved and check it out. It's so worth your time. And now enjoy the video. Double G. Sonic. Has a Sonic Ace ever been seen? Not on the vlog. Not on the vlog. Get it to oh! oh my God. <laughs> Are we back? Yeah. We're hanging out a lot. Yeah. What a guy. T bird. Hey, that guy's on our team, so that's good. Oh, that was 30 <laughs> long, I think. Wow, good putt. Nice putt. Wow, everyone, we're back. After a couple days off, my elbow has been bothering me, so I have been trying to take it slow on throwing hard after all these trick shot videos, challenges, 360s, all in that. I was going really hard and my elbow feels it. That's why we had a short break. But today we are back. Took a vacation. <laughs> Took a one weekend vacation. We have special guests. For the first time on the vlog. Yes. Rick Steeler. What's who is up? the current reigning putting world champion. So we'll make sure to uh, have some cool putts in the vlog yeah, today. Highlight putts, highlight putts today. Highlight putts. And then we have Discman Ambassador and most active person on Instagram I've ever seen. <laughs> True. Rivas, who is kind of a legend here in Massachusetts disc golf scene, of course. And then we have Quentin, Rhode Island. Was that right? Yep. Rhode Island <laughs> superstar. Trying to build the disc golf scene down there. And Ricky actually just moved there, so. Perfect day for a memorial visit to Maple Hill. Enjoy. Simon looking like he's lining up the hyzer. He's going Luster PD2. too white if you have the arm that is the play uh yep king dismania ambassador rivas from latvia the highest highest latvian player in the world apparently shout out to latvia let's see how a world putting champion putts from 20 feet nice putt. looks like it's happened Slid right up, basket's right there, that'll be a putt. That's really good. Mid long. Now I know if I actually let's go. Wow. We got some putts from there. Alright, this is reaction cam. Ah! Four! Ah! <laughs> reaction cam. Through. Does he like it? Oh, a double oh! Ooh, he likes it. <laughs> nice shot. Easy money. So it's one point. So confident. Yeah. Yeah. One point. Simon's in the lead. Slow down. Oh boy, hit a tree. Uh, welcome to Maple. Dude, I got a putt. So Can Simon save it for the team? That looked pretty good. Probably should have chose Simon, bud. This is to push. Uh, what? Wow, roommate Perry. Ricky, no Mega Force, wow. Steeler. Great putt, Ricky. Oh, yeah. Thank right. you. Thank you. Good two. Push. Oh, that one higher, dude. That's it. 
That was pretty good. KC for birdie. Just good putting all around, pretty solid. Thank you for the drive. Second good putt of the day. Is that turning enough? Yeah. Is that going to be super parked? Oh, nice shot. Wolf, thank you. Oh. Simez. <laughs> oh, come on, Casey. You got to save us. All right. Can he save the group? No. Ah, kept it wide. Not low. Not even close. Park. You're still in the lead. Yeah. Until we make our putt. Yeah. That was smooth. Oh yeah. I've done this is very close to the nicest conditions for disc golf. Absolutely no breeze. 72 degrees. Slight sunny, bit overcast, but. It's almost 7 p.m. and it's just awesome. Awesome! Okay, this one's for the sound. Listen close. Wow, Ricky, that was so perfect over the camera. Thanks. Wow. It's the Steve destroyer type of thing. Ah. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I am here with the current putting world champion. That's a putting contest taking place every year at the World Championships. Completely separate event. But to win that, you gotta be like next level good putter, Rick. How did you do it? Uh, yeah, I was like the first car to go off and I knew I was a good putter. Uh, I had a run at it a couple years before, but uh, I kind of just went in with the mentality, just put up the best kind of score I could. And uh, just kind of kept my head down. I was like, just put up a good score in cash and uh, and kind of they all started falling in and then I thought I had a chance and it stuck. So it was pretty crazy. Wow, is that your best title yet of your career? That's the best title of my career right now. So yeah, that's uh, that, that takes the cake over some of the B tiers and C tiers I want, I think. So yeah. Yeah, and you did the pro touring life for two years? Uh, yeah, like a year and a half, like a, a mild tried to travel a lot type of thing. And last year I tried the full tour and this year I was trying it again and it was finally kind of starting to come together and then uh, the Corona was fun. Yeah. So. <laughs> what was your rating or what is your rating? Uh, it's 987 right now. And okay. I think this, this year I was just averaging just over a thousand. Uh, so starting to starting to get it to climb up a little bit. Start, things were starting to click uh, while I was learning the new plastic. Uh, pretty pretty easy switch over but as I was learning it I just felt more and more confident so. so I think a lot of people are interested like for a 980 to a thousand rated player like what's the difference between like your local beat here and like a pro tour I mean I I mean I've been doing it for so long and obviously I've been playing ever since I can remember but for someone with 
like a solid rating, but not in the 1030s or 40s. Like how is that pressure wise and just like, how does it feel? Yeah, it's uh, it's just a kind of a different element. You can't have an off round. Like if I was in a B tier, I could have a 970, 980 round and maybe could fight back and, and compete for the win. If, if you have a 970 round and a pro tour NT, you know, you're, you're out of complete con in contention. You can play for some money, but yeah, you don't get that thrill of still in the hunt type of deal. So uh, you have to be on every single shot. You can't can't kind of lose focus at any point of the round. You can't yeah. give up any point of the round. So it's it's tough. Uh, everyone in the game is so good right now. So It's not as easy guy. as it always looks on Jomez, right? <laughs> yeah, it's way harder. Uh, Paul McBeth is pretty good. Yeah, he makes it look way too easy. Yeah. It's, uh, yeah. Yeah, guys, but then again, the touring life is something special in the disc golf community. It it's is. just, it's always like a cool, cool vibes. Oh yeah, absolutely. All right, great to see you up here and welcome to yeah. almost New, is New England, New Jersey? We, we're, what's the New England no. area? New we're, England we're area. We're in the New England area. All right, nice. We got yeah. another pro. All right. Easy money. Ow. Did that drop? <laughs> oh, come wow, on. Wow, good shot. On it. Thanks. I tried to distract you with my shadow. Did it I work? saw that. Yeah, I was actually like, I was right here and I'm like, what is Simon doing with his hands? I was doing a snake. Yeah. Oh. Easy money. Going to rock. This lighting is just the sickest. That's a putt for two. Yeah. Flex. MD3s. MD3s following each other. Get in shape while you're at it. I'm, I thought I the push up. That was a <laughs> I felt it was the right distance. Get out. Yep, yep, yep. Uh oh. Called that. Called that. That's the second time I did this. Yep. Dude, I saw that little bird. He just blamed the bird. Did he really? Yeah. I thought he blamed the butterfly. <laughs> Let's go, Let's go Rick! Rick. Go. Damn, put a pressure on me now. Point! Nice. We made it to hole 18. It's getting dark. It's 8.08 p.m. This is the latest round of the year for me so far, but I gotta say I've enjoyed every minute. My elbow's been holding up Decent. I felt it, I think, on two shots. But uh, I think if I keep it like easy and no sidearms, I'll be good to go for the tournament season. Last hole. You going on the green or what? Yeah. All right. Yeah, that's really nice. Oh my god. You got it. Oh, oh my god. god. What? Wolf. Is that the best shot this hole has ever seen? That's the best that's wolf. The, that's the best. That's the best wolf shot, shot. this wolf. game has ever seen. Yeah. We'll see where that is. Wow, that was awesome. Is your goal the drop zone? Yeah. I think you achieved that or goal. The green. Get what a shot. That's Obi Long. Wow. That, was, that could have been on the green if I turned it. When did you learn to throw far? Jeez. You taught me. Oh. Holy smokes. Let me get another one. For the vlog. With a beautiful sure. sky that you can't really see, but. Oh! Wow, what a finish. Let's go. Finish in style, there you go, nice. Simon for two on hole 18 white. That's a nice eagle. Game. That is to win. I want to thank everyone for coming today. It was a good battle, it was fun, perfect conditions, but. What do you think of Wolf? 
you know, the strategy. Actually, I, I don't know if I mentioned it earlier, but we played a game called Wolf that is completely new to me. I've never played. We played in a five sim and the first person on the tee gets to throw and then they can call Wolf if they threw a great shot and think they can beat the rest of the players. But if he didn't throw the great shot that he didn't like perfectly, he can go through the other players and watch their shots and decides who is his doubles partner. In our case, we're a five sim. So then the two sim would play against the three sim, depending on who the first thrower chooses as a partner. This probably made no sense to anyone, but check out Wolf Disc Golf, pretty fun. But uh, with that putt, I just won, so <laughs> cheers. How Good was way. it being on the vlog? That was so much fun, guys. You yeah. guys are put out some good stuff. How was it, Rivas? Awesome. Thank you very much. Thanks Appreciate it. Of course. Quentin? Unreal. Gorgeous place. Couldn't have been anywhere better. Nice. Quentin had that Wolf Park job. Let's go. All right, then I have the last word. And I did too. Or Casey wants to say something. Simon got lucky. Oh. True. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Remember to like the video. Hit subscribe if you haven't yet. I think 40% of my people that are watching the videos are not subscribed. Or, no, 40% of my followers are subscribed. So join the family, guys. What are you doing? It helps me out a lot. So see you next time. Check out Patreon. Ben Gleason here with Team Latitude 64. I have a couple of the uh, clinic fuses here. Um, putting it out there for your club would be interested in me coming and throwing a clinic there. I can order these directly from Latitude, free of charge to anybody that shows up. Um, if you'd like me to throw a clinic in your area, please get in touch with me uh, through Facebook Messenger. And um, I travel up and down the East Coast a lot. I'd be more than happy to set up a time and come down and give a clinic. Let's see how these things fly. That's good.